What is up guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Marvel Spider-Man PS4 San Diego Comic-Con 2018 story trailer. I'm super excited for this game. This game on the list of the 2018 games that are coming out is probably above Red Dead, but I do know Red Dead is going to take a lot of my time on my PS4, but I do think Spider-Man is a very strong close second. That E3 trailer from Spider-Man to me stole the show. It was incredible. Even though after The Last of Us, I was in a dark place to Spider-Man at the end. Did brighten things up. I'm excited to see more from it. And today, that's what we got. Comic-Con is here. They're knocking stuff out the park. Trailers left and right. We got a new Spider-Man trailer. I figured I'd do a reaction to it as well. And let's jump straight into it. Because I am excited to see more Spider-Man. I mean, at this point, who isn't? So let's jump in. We got a, about two minutes to review. So let's check it out. Let's hit that play button. Damn. Who is that? Who is that? That kid what is happening in our city, Yuri? I don't know. Feels like the end of the world. Maybe it is. Oscorp Peter building. Parker. How okay. the hell are you? Oh, that was um son. It needs our help. Oh, with the mask off, he kind of knew right, we'll that. Call the play, coach. That was. Gang of costume nut jobs. And that was taking oh, city for piece by piece. Okay. All right. This is opportunity knocking. You know, the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. I've ordered Silver Sable and her team to shoot you on sight. Wait, that's Silver Sable? This city oh. has not been They going the enemy deep, of the bro. That was Kingpin that he knocked out. Jesus Christ. Like, of course Spider-Man is going to save him. Okay, we've seen that. Jesus. Be greater. How do I call you? I mean, do you have like a cell phone in your, <laughs> in your po pockets or something? <laughs> PlayStation. All right, all right, PlayStation. Jesus Christ. That was, that was fire. That was a cool little niffy trailer. Again, for Comic-Con, it was cool. My thoughts on it overall, I mean, I'm pretty hyped for this game. This trailer is hype. There's a lot of stuff that I'm seeing in this trailer and I don't know the answers to. And it's like, how is he without his mask in that scene right there? Without it being like, oh, you're Spider-Man? You know what I'm saying? Maybe we do get that old moment in earlier in the game, and that was a scene that was later on. But it just seemed like he, Peter was so comfortable there that he was like, I ain't gonna give, you know, Oscorp, um, this guy the business. And I'm like, curious on that. Also curious on um, Shorty, on how she's gonna be portrayed in the game, how that fight scene is gonna go. Because we've seen a lot of the boss battle-ish scene at the end of the E3 trailer. She seems like a more of a fighter, like someone that's gonna be in your face. I would think more like the Batman versus, I forget the guy's name, De Deathstroke type of fight in the video game that I would want to see Spider-Man and Shorty have to kind of fit that in that same, I don't want to say feel, but I'm more curious on that, on seeing how that's gonna play out because Seeing Spider-Man fight some of these villains, I, I, I would think that it would just be a something that you just have to do probably in the world to get them down and then beat them up or whatever the case may be. She does, she seems like somebody you're going to have to be in her face and be fighting as well smartly with the world, but more in her face fighting. I'm excited for that as well as them just, again, just a, this living, breathing Spider-Man world with all these characters, not scared to show Mary Jane, not scared to show what it looks like to be. Um, Miles, 
Not scared to show Oz, um, Oscorp and stuff like that. And this guy, I'm very excited on, again, seeing all of this stuff inside of the game. This trailer though, if I had to give it a grade, it was good. It was a great trailer. It had me excited. You know, the sound of course is, is superb. It answered a lot of questions, but then it also gave me a ton more questions. As far as, again, about hype level for this trailer, I didn't know it was coming. But the E3 one, I guess I was I was more satisfied at the end of that trailer. Now, I mean, they did show more and we did see, we're getting closer to the game. So we did see a lot of this stuff before, you know, with the Mr. Negative and all this, you know, all the other villains that are in the game that we've seen. I do think that we're at the point that they're just reusing stuff and if that makes any sense, even though we've seen a lot of new footage in this. You could clearly say that a lot of this stuff was 100% new. I feel like because we did get Get introduced to all these characters and stuff already it did take that uh, out of this trailer so i'm gonna have to give it a four out of five and again that's still good it's still great but i i feel like there's something missing in this trailer and i can't i can't call it i don't know what it is it's just something that uh it's just I wish it was there. Let me know what you would give this Spider-Man trailer in the comment section below. And do you agree with me with it being a four out of five? If you would grade it higher, let me know why, because maybe I'm not seeing it. Maybe there's something that is here that I, I'm not clicking with and I'm trying to figure out why too, because I'm a Spider-Man fan and it should be clicking with me, but it's not. So let me know your thoughts on that in the comment section below. Oh my God, I wanted to add this to this video, but look at this fucking PS4 Special Edition Spider-Man. Oh my God. <laughs> we got the fucking God of War one, the fucking Kingdom Hearts one that's coming out later this year. And then this beautiful red, oh my God. I don't, I'm not in love with the controller, but oh my God. I just decided to add this in because it was so fucking, it looks so good. Let me know your thoughts on the fucking Special Edition in the comment section below. Like always guys, I'm Daddy and my friend on Instagram. Instagram and Twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube and yes I'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one So if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video Peace, I'm gonna see you guys on the next one